Hey everyone, Michael O'Brien, and welcome to the Pokedex tutorial, where we're gonna turn your iPhone into a real Pokedex that's gonna allow you to do some really cool Pokemon-themed tricks, right? So if you look here, uh, you see we have all of these different Pokemon from Generation 1 all throughout the Pokedex, right? And you could do some really cool stuff. So for example, I could have the spectator swipe just like this. Of course, we'll hold the phone down so they can't see what they're doing. They'll swipe as much as they want until we find a Pokemon at random. Now this one here, if you could see, we have Bulbasaur. Now if I really wanted to catch Bulbasaur, all I'd have to do is whoosh, pop it right off the screen. And the best part is, is if you look now, you'll see that he's actually gone from the Pokedex, right? And we could produce a little Bulbasaur figure. Now, another thing that we could do too, is we could make a prediction, right? If you look here, you'll see I have a Pokeball. And we're gonna do the same kind of thing now, okay? We're gonna swipe through just like this, and they're gonna pick a couple of different Pokemon, right? So they'll swipe through, We'll do it face down so they could swipe at random just like this. And the first one is Eevee. Very cute little guy. And we'll have them choose a second one as well, right? Same thing, face down so they can't quite see exactly which Pokemon it is that they're choosing. Face swipe as much as they want. And in this case, we landed on Pikachu. Now, I haven't done anything, right? The Pokeball has been right here in plain view the entire time. But once you open it, you'll see inside is a little figure. And that figure is a little Pikachu wearing an Eevee costume. Isn't that cute? Super adorable, right? So in this video here, I'm gonna walk you through everything that comes inside of the set. I'm gonna give you guys some information on where you could pick up different bits just in case. Maybe you purchased a digital only version of this, or maybe you're missing certain things like, maybe you're like, dude, where'd you get that really, really cool Pokedex phone case for your phone? So you can actually turn your phone into a Pokedex, right? Where do I get all that stuff? We're gonna talk about that in this video. Now, the second part of the video tutorial series is gonna teach you how to get everything set up how to download everything from obrienmagic.com, getting all the digital assets on your phone, and then setting up your photo albums and how to set up the shortcuts. Now the shortcuts are designed to perform the effect for you, making it 100% automated so you don't have to do anything. The phone will do all of the work for you. And a huge shout out to Dale Moore for programming these shortcuts for us. These are so cool. And like I said, you're gonna have to set all this stuff up but once you get it set up and once you get it working, it's gonna make this so easy to perform. In fact, it's so easy. <laughs> My seven-year-old daughter, Brianna, she can actually perform this effect, right? The one that I just showed you, where you, uh, where you produce a little figure from the Pokeball, uh, she is able to perform that effect. It's really that easy. The phone just does all of the work for you. Now, the third video in this series is gonna walk you through all of the different routines and things that you can do with this. Of course, I just showed you a couple of them right now, but there are so many different things that you can do using Pokedex, right? So for example, you could do mind reading type effects, right? So you can have them choose a Pokemon at random. You can tell them what the Pokemon looks like, the Pokemon's num uh, name, its number, uh, what type it is, electric, psychic, grass, poison, etc. The Pokemon's height, weight, what evolutionary stage it's in, and I even built um, a sort of uh, long word principle type thing into uh, the Pokedex entry. So you can reveal a thought of word from the Pokedex entry at the bottom of the screen. So you could do some mind reading stuff. There's productions, there's predictions. There's even gonna be a memorized stack segment on this project. So I really hope that you guys are excited. Without further ado, let's see what all comes inside. All right, so as I mentioned before, uh, when you purchase Pokedex, you're either gonna get the digital only version and you're gonna be expected to go out and find your own props, or if you purchase the bundle deal, the complete Pokedex set, it's gonna come with all this stuff that you see on the table here. So you're gonna get uh, a little toy Pokeball. You can place one or two or even three figures inside of the ball there, right? Stay. 
Come on, don't move. There you go, perfect. <laughs> you get a little toy Pokeball. You're gonna get an assorted Pokemon card. Now this Pokemon card is gonna be one of the original 150 Pokemon, um, the ones that you're gonna find inside of the slides, but um, it's gonna be assorted. So I don't know exactly which one you're gonna get. In this case, we got Eevee here. And then you're also gonna get eight Pokemon figures, right? So these are the figures that you can produce from the phone or you can put them inside of the ball as a prediction and all of that good stuff, right? We got Bulbasaur, we got Psyduck, uh, we got Pikachu, Squirtle, all these different ones. And then you have a couple of these uh, hybrid Pokemon, that I like to call them, right? Where they actually reveal <laughs> a couple of different things, right? You got like the Eevee Chews, right? You got like Pikachu wearing an Eevee costume or Eevee wearing a Pikachu costume. You got Psyduck with an Eevee inner tube, right? All of these different cool um, little things. You got Owlette uh, wearing a little Pikachu hat, right? So all of these figures, all eight of them will be included in the set. And um, last but not least, you'll also get um, all 151 original Pokemon images here. These are, I'm gonna call these the Pokemon slides. You're gonna get all 151 original Pokemon slides that you can put onto your phone and they're all unique, right? It's not like the same thing over and over again with just different pictures. They're all very unique, right? So for example, this is Gold Duck here. The Pokedex entry says, when it swims at full speed, its forehead will begin to glow, right? Ivasaur, the bulb on its back gives off a pleasant aroma. Grimer, it's born from pollution and is very toxic. So as you can see, they're all different. We have different types, psychic, normal, fairy, water, ground, rock, all of these different types. And then the really cool part too, like you saw, some of the Pokemon, you can actually make the image vanish from the screen uh, so that you could produce the Pokemon just like I did a little while ago uh, when I pulled Bulbasaur out from the screen, right? So a lot of really cool stuff you can do with these slides and all of that. Now, again, I mentioned this uh, Pokedex iPhone case. This is not going to be included in the Pokedex complete set. These will be available for a limited time. Uh, you can purchase these through me. I do have these made from a third party. So if you guys do decide that you want to pick up an iPhone case for your phone, you can order it from me and then I'll have it custom made and sent out to you. Uh, in a separate package. So it's not gonna arrive at the same time as all of the other stuff that you're ordering. It will arrive separately, because like I said, these are made on demand. But it's a pretty cool little case. And I have them um, in over uh, 15 different styles. So if you have an iPhone 10 or 12 or a new 16 or whatever, we got mini, we got pro, we got max, we got all of that stuff, right? So please um, go ahead and check out uh, the purchase link Right? So if you've already bought this stuff before, but maybe you didn't get the phone case, or uh, if you're looking at the digital only version of this, I'm gonna have purchase links there for you um, at obrienmagic.com. Just go to the Pokedex uh, purchase link and you'll see separate categories for all these things. So you can pick up the extra bits and pieces that you need just in case, again, like I said, you either didn't buy them initially or you got the digital only version and so on and so forth, right? So that's all the stuff that is gonna come inside the set. That's all the add-ons and all of that good stuff. Again, thank you so much for picking up Pokedex. It really means a lot to me. You guys rock, right? <laughs> so we're gonna have a good time. And uh, the reason that I'm so excited about this is because Pokemon holds a special place in my heart, but not just myself. There are people my age and all the way down to my daughter, she's seven years old, who love Pokemon. It holds a special place in your heart. It's packed full of nostalgia and all that. And uh, it's the perfect everyday carry that you can just keep right here on your phone. And you can do some really cool stuff. You can do some child-friendly mentalism. Can you believe it? Mentalism that kids are actually gonna enjoy. So. Thank you so much for watching this first part. Let's go ahead and dive into part two now and learn how to download everything from the website, get everything installed into your phone and set up the shortcuts and photo albums.